you know, the further we get into Dress Rosa and the, the shenanigans afoot, I tend to just think to myself, what happened with the Thousand Sunny? Big Mom attacked and we just went radio silent. They could all be dead for all I know. But ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to this channel. My name is Jack the Bus. And yes, the reactions to Dress Rosa continue. I'm very excited to get into it today. If you're new to the channel, make sure you drop a sub, drop a fat like on this one. It does help me out quite a bit. And let's get started. I'm holding a blade opening mail and whatnot get me in there why is bart so shocked he knows robin's a straw hat he knows she's goaded dude imagine if the if, if bart met the entire crew at once i think he would actually just pass away it's a good thing the rest of them aren't here actually now that i think about it it's weird how he doesn't make sense oh he's back oh he's like fading Hakuba? That's like his alter ego? Hakuba and Cavendish. Jekyll and Hyde. How does he like snap out of it? I thought it's just whenever he's asleep. Hey man, you good? Listen, man. It's in the past. Everybody's talking about. Who? Who's talking? What? Like down there on the plateau. Is there any reasoning behind it that he can give us or no? Oh, he's asleep again. Bro. Is this like, it's called narcolepsy, right? Where you just fall asleep randomly. Does Cavendish have that? Because it doesn't even seem like he's falling asleep. He's more just like fading in and out. <laughs> like it just happens so quickly. This isn't even a devil fruit too, he said. He didn't have one because when they were in the Coliseum, he said he wanted the flare flare fruit. Is this how they stall Robin getting up there to helping Rebecca and Kiros? Yo, that looks sick though. If he can like lock it down and use that to his advantage. He could be really strong. I'm the only Cavendish. I mean, I don't think he's claiming to be Cavendish. He just wants his body. Oh, he got, oh wait, no, it's Gladius. Is he putting a bomb from down there? Well, they stalled just a little bit too long. Dude, I love that sound effect. It's the same as Ursus Shock. Oh my gosh, he said the title of the show, Chills. Yeah, do something, Bart! Can Robin fly, please? She can do that with her hands. Get him, Bart! He just growed it in the... What? Oh, that's why his hair, like, grew out. He uses it as ammunition. Poison? What? That just seems unfair. Bart, no! Pop, pop. He's growing large. Oh my gosh. He's sell. He's just gonna blow up. <laughs> Bro. All of his hair will shoot out. Oh my gosh. He has to pick? Dude, no. Bart's gonna throw himself in the way for Robin. He knows his priority to protect. It's the goddamn straw hats. <laughs> Dude, look at him. His face is just gone. You should just like let Kevin just fall asleep and then just drop him. Somebody expendable. He's going to sacrifice cabbage. I don't think Cavendish would agree to that. And it's not even him anymore. Think, think. I like how Gladius is just sitting here letting Bart decide. Oh. His arm's sticking out, bro! He doesn't have any out right now, though. Maybe, like, contain Gladius? He is! Wait, he's trapping himself, though! And then he's gonna make him blow up! Bar, no! Oh my gosh! Damn! He is just gonna blow up! No! Wait, that would just destroy Gladius too, though, no? It would be a trade. And he's still got his fingers crossed. Because it would nullify his rupture in the wall. No, Bart. I think he's okay. Dang, that's my go right there, baby. That's my hero. I'll do anything for the straw hats. That, yeah, that might spell the end of like both Bart and, and uh, Gladius's parts in this, though. His whole coat is gone. He was so fashionable. No way is he still up. No way, man. He can just blow up like that? Oh. Oh my gosh, man. Missed his heart? Oh, his hair! Oh my gosh! 
The deal? Oh, it's still active. So the one in the mountain is still active. Robin, drop Cavendish! Oh, the bubble's still there. Maybe that's where he's strongest, where half of him is Hakuba. With Hakuba's quickness. Like, he'll grab her and run? It's like a gamble on whether or not Hakuba would hurt him. Hurt her. Bro, that's gonna blow up the entire plateau! She has to trust... She has to trust Cavendish. Wouldn't that harm Pika? No, I guess Pika's further down. Nah, she, she's trusting Cavendish. She had to. Dude, Bart's POV, he, he thinks Robin just died because he wasn't able to, to stop him. They're gone, but... Yep, uh-huh. Dude, why would, why would I believe that they would take down Cavendish and Robin like that? Oh, he's stabbing himself. Is that how he stays, like, locked in? Oh my gosh. All right, they made it. Now, where's Kiros? Oh, Cabbage grabbed it when Haka... Oh, my gosh. Dang, bro. Bar and Cavendish coming in hot. He's pissed now. Dude, the music's swelling. He's actually going to attack Gladius. <laughs> he would keep fighting. I love how this is the flashback they chose. He was there! That's right! He said that, didn't he? Oh my gosh, I totally forgot he said that. Dude, I swear every day they add someone else to the, the like the fact that they were there. I think he said that's where his like love for Luffy started. Pretty sure. And that's when he started following them. Oh, dude. <laughs> dude, what are gonna happen to the bounties from Dress Rosa? And maybe even Punk Hazard. I don't know. Oh my gosh! He emulated Luffy! Bart is so freaking adorable, bro. If only Luffy could see him now. Dude, pre Coliseum already feels like ages ago. Bro, no way we're flashing back to Luffy and Chin Zhao. Oh my gosh. You're off one, Toei. He's getting up, baby. Dude, it's not over. Holy fist? Oh, shoot. He puts a barrier around his- Oh! Oh! That's gonna hurt, bro. It's indestructible. Oh! He is right now, though. <laughs> okay, dude. He did piss the- Oh, shoot! This is so cute, man. He just wants to be like his hero. Dude, Gladys is done. He actually did it. He calls it Luffy's power. Dude, he has to become a straw hat. He, I, I, I don't know, man. It's just, uh, he's his hero. He is so behind him becoming King of the Pirates. Nah, nah. Yeah, bro, how do you block that? Like, actual, <gasps> yes! Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Mama's here. That was a 3v1. What was the mission? Oh, 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 oh Law. Yeah. Yeah, Law, Law is not doing too hot, guys. I'm, I'm going to be honest. We may have accomplished that mission, but uh, there's there's like 50 more now. Dude, Bar is just the sweetest, man. Like, it's so cool. I, I know, like, as people get to know Luffy and the Straw Hats, they get very behind them because they see how good they are. But it's cool seeing someone that is just such a fanboy and wants to see him as King of the Pirates before anything. Like, all it took was Logetown. He's just a unique character in that sense. And finding unique characters, like, personality-wise, in that way this far in is just very impressive. I mean, not to say there's no variety in characters, but like somebody that, that's behind Luffy like that without having even met him. It's just cool, dude. All right, next, next episode. Wait, we're on the sunflower field? Uh-huh. Oh, Diamante's getting pissed. You're not doing a very good job at it, man. Yeah, you got backup, baby. I bet the three of them together could take down Diamante. I was already pretty confident in Kiros because he's this legendary soldier, but with Robin's help, for sure. Oh, we're back to Gladius. They're carrying him away. The Bart is built. Show some samurai-like mercy. Get yourselves together. Hmm. 
Do they, do they have a plan, actually? First floor of the royal palace, back in the chapel. Oh, they're taking all of them. Oh, bro, bro. These grunts, man. What about Lao G? Oh my gosh. <sighs> Jola's back. I forgot about her. We've honestly been, been blessed to not have her in a fight. I'm not gonna lie. I feel like my brain just kind of melts when she's on the screen. I'm not going to lie. Mm, do you have a plan of action, Jola? Tokari and Gladius. Are oh, they just piling their bodies up? Get things going. Uh, there's more to this. It to me. Oh my gosh, bro. I forgot about Frankie fighting pink. Dude, it's just like so much time passes it. <laughs> this fight, man. How will this end? Oh, they're updating Viola. I like how they're not interrupting Frankie and Pink's fight, though. It's, it's respectable. Dude, Leo my goat, bro. Yeah, they're going to rescue her. Oh! Oh, Manchuri is part of Jola's plan. We still don't even know what Manchuri does. So if Jola gets her hands on Manchuri too soon, I guess they'll move her, too. These two goats, bro. Oh my gosh. Going to rescue their princess. We haven't even seen Manchuri like completely. I don't know why it's like teasing her. There she is. Tantata tribe. She's Tonto's daughter. Dude, her little cheeks are like, they're like rosy. Oh, she's so small. Who did you call Boa Hancock? Wait, what? Wait, what? 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 What does that mean? Why don't we just bring up Boa Hancock? Resuscitate the executive. Heal, heal, fruit? Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, no. I think I have a prediction. They're going to catch Leo and say, either use your power or we'll kill him. Oh, no. This is going to be, this is going to backfire so hard. She recovered sugar. Heal, heal, fruit. Can she just like fully heal anybody? Spit, Mansuri, spit! She knows the truth, and she's, like, all alone, too. That's crazy. It's very impressive. Especially considering Tontadas are very easily tricked. She feels bad for her? Bro. She's just so small. Oh, so she's just making stuff up. She's saying that she's calling her beautiful because she said Boa Hancock. Oh, wait, what? Dude, some character tropes, are just, they, they, they're so confusing to me. Not tropes, but like, um, like they're, they're quirks, I guess. Yep, she's threatening them. Facts, man, Cherie, true. She's gonna torture her? Dude, I feel like Leo's gonna become the prince. They're like, they're like in love. He's the future king of the Tantana. I mean, he acts like it, bro. He gets stuff done. Oh, Cubs down. You got, you gotta leave him. Sorry, dude. Say what you want about the Tantanas. They are a resilient bunch. I just like how he uses two needles. He's just cracked with it, and he just keeps going. Where does she get the watering? Does she like spawn it with her devil fruit? Bro, she's just like bending her. This is so messed up. Oh no, wait, her tears? Oh no, is that what heals them? She has to cry to use it? Oh no, I don't think Jola even knew. <gasps> now she's gonna make her cry. Oh no. She didn't know. Oh no. Bro, you could like stock that up in like a bottle. Oh, no. Dude, Jola proving that she can't even do anything in combat, and she's basically just there to heal the other executives. The worst executive by far, man. <laughs> Dude, all of them knocked out together. Cry! I don't know how I feel about her cheeks. It's so bizarre how it's just like, it looks like scribbles. It's such a unique design. Bro, you're just slapping the hell out of her. How close is Leo? Oh, no. Don't tell me they all get healed, man. Leo just like fighting an army. She's like, hurry up. 
Dude. <laughs> You are not making it all the way up there, Muji. No wonder they said Doflamingo wanted to use her. That is insanely useful. It's like a Sinzu bean in the form of, of Water. Duke. I love Kinemai and Kajiro so much, bro. They're just like these random wild cards. Usopp's like, I have to do this again! Dude, if he has to fire a third shot, scare her for a third time. They're all cheering Leo on. Dude, I feel like Leo's gonna burst in the room and all of the executives will be up. That'd be like Omega Disasterville, though. Oh, there's the door. Dude, look at this beast, man. Oh my gosh. Damn! This is my go, bro. Kill Jola, Leo. Slice her up. No. Did she already do it? Wait, she's not even over the executives anymore. Round two! We're like 80 episodes in! What do you mean round two? Oh, shoot! He's gonna catch the tears! How? Wait, how, actually? We just move the bodies! Oh my gosh! The strategies! Damn! He's sewing them together? Oh my gosh. Yeah, try, Jola. Oh my god, he's sewing her too. What? Is, are they just stuck now? Oh my gosh! chair. Patchwork. Dang, bro! Oh my gosh! Leo is kind of him, man! And they didn't get healed! She sees her hero! Oh, it's beautiful! <laughs> oh my gosh! My goat! Look at this Chadathan! Dang, bro. <laughs> and Viola just watched the whole thing. Oh my gosh, bro. They were all about to be back up. That would have been disastrous. Oh my gosh. Manchetti is saved. Is this her heart, man? <laughs> bro, now Manchuri can like use her power on, on allies. I know, Manchetti. I know. You don't have to be anymore. Brother! What are you saying? Same old. Oh my gosh. Okay, back to the palace. Is Bellamy seriously still bouncing? There is no way. Oh my gosh, he is! Bellamy, if you're gonna kill yourself, just do it all right. I'm sorry. That was unnecessary. I don't mean that. I care about him. Without trying to attack. It's just like old times, huh, man? Gone through some unexpected event. He was like this when you met him the first time. What? What shattered his confidence? Oh, Marine Ford? Bro. Bro. Bellamy, you're tripping blood. What are you doing? Why? Oh my God. I think it's actually getting to the point where Luffy will have to take him down. But at least the princess is saved. And finally, we find out what her devil fruit does. And it was not disappointing in the slightest. That's actually very broken. So she said like, get out your watering can. So I'm guessing she like stores tears in this watering can. I don't know if she like, actually carries it around. I don't know where she'd keep it. But Joa probably just figured it was like some kind of a special water that she could spawn when in reality it's just her tears so can she just like cry really easily on i guess we saw her crying in her cell so i guess she cries really easily but what if she needs to heal like and she's not sad you know what i mean <laughs> but slowly but surely we progress more and more gladius is taken down robin has finally made it to the top floor and bellamy is still bouncing around it kind of sucks because i feel like the weight of everything with bellamy was very it was, it was there at first but because this uh, uh, at least this section in particular has been drug out a bit. I kind of just want to see it come to whatever solution or, or conclusion that it is. Every 
everything else i think has been distanced pretty well like frankie fighting senor pink we haven't gotten a ton of that it just hasn't happened in a while law fighting doflamingo like he got his whole arm cut off like there's been developments there luffy and bellamy fell down here like what, 10 episodes ago and we're in the same spot but dude yeah leo is for real him man like that pff. if we're talking arc mvps him and bart are pretty high up there i'm not gonna lie guys that's been it for my reaction today i hope you did enjoy make sure you leave a like on this one it does help me out quite a bit and i'll catch you next time this base